Hello parents, this is Chris Allen here at Paramarine High School. I am the Calc BC teacher and I wanted to give you a quick update of September 7. So this week in class we are focusing on something called the substitution method for integration. And so let's say that I ask uh, the students to evaluate the following definite integral. Um, and I will note this is actually kind of a more challenging problem. Um, so I'm actually going to share this video with the students and see if they can get the same results that I got. So we want to evaluate this integral um, x square root x plus 6 dx from 0 to 3. So we're going to use something called the substitution method. So if you look at the quantity under the square root, we can let that equal u. And then the derivative of u, or du, would be dx. It should be noted that that u equals x plus 6 can be rewritten as x equals u minus 6. And therefore, I can substitute these three expressions into our original integral. It also should be noted that the limits of integration are going to change by this u substitution. So 0 is going to change to 6, and 3 is going to change to 9. And the way that we got that is, again, we use the definition there of u. u is x plus 6. So that means that our original integral could be rewritten as the integral of u minus 6 times u to the 1 half du from 6 to 9. We can then distribute the u to the 1 half, which will give us the following integral. And now we're going to start using the fundamental theorem of calculus. So we need to find the antiderivative of that expression, which turns out to be 2 fifths u to the 5 halves minus 4 u to the 3 halves. And to finish this off, we need to just simply substitute 9 in for the antiderivative and then minus 6 in for the antiderivative which will give us a final result of negative 54 plus 48 root 6, all divided by 5. That is the exact answer. Some final thoughts for the week. Um, I just want to remind parents and students that so far this semester, it's mainly been review material from last year, so we're just kind of fine-tuning our skills from last year. Um, in fact, I think the only thing new that has been taught was Newton's method. Uh, next week, September 15th, uh, Tuesday, I'm going to have a call-out meeting for the Math League competition, which is a club, a math club that's a pretty low commitment for students, but it's something really nice for them to put on their uh, college application, for example, that they were involved in an academic team. Um, all that information can be found on my Canvas webpage. And finally, I wanted to thank um, you parents for your support here um, for us teachers at Paramarines High School. So. Hope you guys have a great day.